Okay, guys. Killer K here. Welcome back to another episode of Kim's Killer Sources. I apologize for all the internet con and connection issues that I had just before. But as most of you guys know, we're reviewing some of Gammy's Hot Sauce. We're reviewing He's on Fire. And he won first place in the Mr. Chili Awards this year for the 2020 Mr. Chili Awards in the hot category. And it went up against sources as Mr. Mungo and Kapow Hot Sauce. So that's awesome. Awesome achievement. I'm just going to put some stuff below here. This is the links and everything to Drew's page on Facebook. Uh, if you guys want to grab some sauce yourselves. So I'll just wait until Drew gets in here. I'll also post the link to the website just there. So it should it should post the the link now in the chat uh, to Drew's hot sauce page just there below. So on Facebook and on YouTube, I tagged that in. So we should be we should be rolling with that one. Uh, hey, Facebook user, I'm not too sure who you are, but get a get a get a. But we'll just wait on Drew to jump into the live stream and we'll get this review going. Like I said, I apologize for all the internet connection issues earlier. We should be fine now. Uh, sound should be hopefully good now. Everything should be good. But again, we are reviewing Gammy's Hot Sauce. And yeah. There's a lot of Facebook users here. Um, I don't know who you are, but hi guys. How are you? Good to see you. Uh, if anyone can just tag Drew, I've tagged him. He's here, beautiful. So we're reviewing his He's on Fire. Again, who won first place in the 2020 Mr. Chili Awards in the hot category. So that's an achievement just in itself, entering your source first year running and winning a first place prize. So that's absolutely awesome. So ingredients, and we'll get to reviewing this sauce. So ingredients are... Seasonal exotic chilies blended with peaches, molasses, spices, garlic, mustard, and apple cider vinegar. So we also have our Chase the Heat hot sauce spoon. Mother of Pell. Get yours at chasetheheat.com. All right. So let's get into it. So it's 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 been making my mouth water just looking at this in my collection. I'm also I also have Illusion which I'll be reviewing on Christmas Day as like a Christmas Day special with a couple of other sauces. So I'll also be reviewing uh, Drew's uh, Illusion Hot Sauce also on Christmas Day. So stay tuned for that one, guys. So get this open here. Maybe, maybe I should have... Uh, oh, don't worry. I've got scissors here. I apologize for any background noise. Um... Obviously, I can't help background noise, but my mother-in-law's on the phone, so the lid is off, or the seal's off. But look at the colour. Because I've got my windows open, you can actually see the the colour. Quite, quite, it's quite a thick sauce, actually. But let's get to review on this thing. Let's see if there's a nipple or not on this one, huh? No, oh, no nipple. Awesome work, Drew. I love when there's no nipples. It makes my life so much easier because who needs restrictors, right? Here we go, a paw. Yeah, quite thick. Like a tomato barbecue sauce type consistency, but this is... Gammy's hot sauce. He's on fire. Just want to give a massive shout out again to Drew for sending this bottle to me and let me be the first one to review this sauce. But cheers. Mm. Sweet. It's 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 not smoky, but there's no smoky. Maybe from the molasses. I, I know molasses is really sweet, but it's got like a, a, a smoky type flavor to it. It's, re it's really bizarre because there's no real ingredients that say that it's got any smoke in it. Straight away you get the peaches. 
peach is straight through. Heat on my scale, I'm really not getting any heat. Um, but I have been eating ridiculous amounts of Reapers as of recent. So um, I would say this is a mild sauce. Great flavor, pack full of flavor. Yeah, the pe peaches and molasses, man. Like I don't know. It's for me. It's almost got like a smoky flavor. It's re it's really bizarre because, like I said, there's no real smokiness into the, in the sauce. This would be awesome on ice cream, to be honest. White meats, pork, fish, even over salad, I reckon. This is really nice, guys. Like it. it, it, it Initially, you get a nice little hit of chili, and then the sweetness from the peaches and the molasses come through really nice. Drew, man, I'd be very, very proud of that one. And the fact that it's won a first prize in the Mr. Chili Awards in the hot category, man, I'd be very, very happy. Um, that is a great tasting sauce, man. Great on anything sweet. Ice cream, waffles, fruit, even if like a fruit platter, over a fruit platter, any type of fish, chicken. I mean, it's the chilies are lightly smoked over applewood. There you go. That's where I'm getting the smokiness. See, I, I knew I could, I could, I knew I could feel a little bit of a smoky, a smoky flavor. I picked that up, even though it wasn't in the ingredients. I picked, I picked up a smoky flavor. So my taste, my, my tasting must be on on point. So. There you go. There's the smokiness from it, guys. So I'm a, I'm a, I must be somewhere all right with my flavors. Hey, hey, Michael, how are you, dude? Uh, nice of you to stop by. But Drew, mate, uh, now the sun's in the way. <laughs> that is a great sauce, man. Guys, he's only a small batch hot sauce maker, but get your hands on some gummies. You won't be disappointed. I. I almost want to have like chicken or something tonight and smother that all over it. It's got a it's got a really nice burn. It's not 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 a crazy burn. So even entry entry level chili heads are going to enjoy this. It might be sort of medium for you guys. My scale's a little bit broken at the moment, so I've just got a nice little warmth in the back of my throat and over the tongue. Yeah, for a non-chili head or just someone that occasionally likes chili. It's going to be hot for you. It's not going to be blazing hot, but it's 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 definitely got a little bit of a kick there. But I always prefer flavor over fire anyway. So, uh, dude, <laughs> awesome tasting sauce. You definitely need to enter that again next year, man. I can see you winning a, a lot of awards from that. That's a really, really tasty sauce, which makes me... Can't wait for the illusion because if that is awesome, the illusion is going to be sensational because I love pineapples. I love the Kang Star Lemon Starburst and the color of that sauce is incredible. Let, let me let me, let me me grab the sauce quickly and show you how awesome the color of this sauce is. One second. So this is the color of the illusion. Just awesome, awesome, awesome color. Awesome, beautiful color. It's quite runny too. Nah, Breezy, you do it first. Uh, I, I don't want to be that guy. <laughs> but I'm happy to do it, but it's just, it's just teasing me. It's teasing me. Okay, I'll tell you what, Breezy. If I get the okay from Drew, I'll review it. I'll review it now. So we'll have like a double review of Gammy's hot sauce today. If not, you review it tomorrow, and I'll do it on Christmas Day. But we'll wait. We'll wait for Gammy's opinion because, uh, like I said, I don't want to be that guy to stomp over your your sort of step on your feet and your toes. I'm not that guy. I know I'm never that guy, but I just don't want to be that guy because he sent the illusion for you to review also. 
but if it's fine with you, Breezy, and it's fine with Drew, I'm more than happy to review review Illusion right now, because um, it's 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 a very nice and teasing looking source. Um, yeah, but Drew, give me the heads up if it's fine to review today. If not, if not, I'm always happy to let Breezy review it, and I'll review it on Christmas Day. So. I'm happy either way, but <laughs> that sauce is incredible. I mean, Breezy, get yourself a bottle of this. This is awesome. Really, 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 really awesome. Uh, like I said, get yourself a bottle, Breezy. You won't be disappointed. And you like, if you like sweet, I know, I know you like sweet heat, Breezy. You're not a real crazy, crazy heat. You'll love this. Definitely get your hands on a bottle, Breezy. You're gonna absolutely love this sauce. Um, but Drew, what are we saying, brother? Uh, what are we saying? Am I am I good to review Illusion? I only want to do it if it's all right with you. Um, let me say, let me let me inbox you now. Is it okay? I don't even know if you're here live. I think you are, but. I just don't want to be stepping on anybody's toes, and if, uh, like I said, if he wants to review from you first, Breezy, I'm more than happy for you to review that. I just got a bottle because I seen you post that up, and it looked incredible. And the Lemon Starburst are my new favorite chilies. Uh, thanks, Breezy. <laughs> Morning. Uh, so, I'm not too sure if Drew's in here, because um, I haven't I haven't seen any comments from him. Um, so I think I might just I might just end the live stream here, because again I, I, I don't want to be stepping on your toes, Breezy. Um, I know you said that I'm not doing that, but I'll let you review the source and I'll review it on Christmas Day. It's completely fine with me. But guys, that was my review on. Oh well. Do it if Bree's okay with it. Oh, okay, so he's here. Well, I'll do it then. Uh, as long as I'm not making anybody upset, I'll, I'm ha happy to do that right now. So, Illusion from Gammy's, Gammy's Hot Sauce. I just love the color of this sauce. It's just only me. Okay, that's all right then. <laughs> I love you guys. <laughs> I love you guys. Uh, you guys are awesome. All right, so I'm going to review this sauce because I've heard nothing but good things about Drew's whole range, but this is one of the sauces I've been looking forward to because just just wait and see the ingredients that I show you. I read out to you guys on this awesome sauce, and, like, the color of it is just beautiful. I don't even think I want to use a spoon for this one because it's got awesome – awesome awesome uh ingredients in it so let me read the ingredient looks like sunny in a bottle right so the ingredients are seasonal exotic chilies blended with fresh pineapple oh, yum pineapple melon uh lime juice white rum oh my god <laughs> and apple cider vinegar so the chilies in this i know what chilies are in it are the kang style and starburst my new favorite <laughs> chug it my new favorite chilies so let me get this bad boy open. Like I said, this thing's been making, these two sources have been making my mouth water just by the ingredients that are in them. Where did I put those scissors? Right here. All right. All right. Can we get it off? Yes. Oh. I tell you what, Drew, you've done a great job sealing these things. Really running consistency again would be awesome on ice creams and whatnot. All right, let's open it. Oh, Jesus, it's on there tight. Oh, there we go. Oh, my God. You can smell that coconut straight away, that coconut rum. Oh, my God. Shot glass. You know what? Let's Let, let me get a shot glass. I'll get a...
All right, shot glass. We're going to use our League of Fire shot glass. So this is Drew Gammy's illusion. Oh, look at that. Very fresh summery sauce. I reckon this is just summer in a bottle, this one. But almost summer in a bottle. Summer in a bottle. All right, so Drew Gammy's illusion. Yeah, look at that color. How incredible. Beautiful. And the smell. You, you, you get the smell from the coconut rum. Oh, my God. Just making my mouth water. All right, cheers. Mm. Oh, my God. Wow. Sweetness from the pineapple straight away. The slight coconut in the background. The rum. Slight little kick from the Kangstar Lemon Starburst. Oh, my God, dude. This is awesome. Has this one won an award? It surely has to have. Third place, man. That's awesome. It should should be number one. Mm. Bree, you're going to love this sauce. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah, it's... It's what I love about doing what I do. Sometimes you just come across the sauces that are really, really special and make you really, really, really happy. This is one of those. Mm. It tastes like, like a Malibu pineapple alcoholic drink. Sorry, Drew. Um, that was too good. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. I just chugged a whole bottle of sauce on camera. Mate, what can I say? That is one tasty sauce, and I'm glad I bought a bottle off you, man. Well, I'm not so glad now, because now I don't have a bottle of sauce, but flavor pineapple coconut rum oh my god like it's just ex an explosion of flavor really 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 sweet and for the guys that know i love sweet third in the tropical category okay that that's the category <laughs> Chew Chew Yeah, yeah, everyone won't like it. So, set, yeah, set, set, send me the bottles for the disposal. I'll, I'll, I'll kindly take them. I'll kindly take them. Definitely, you could make you could make an alcoholic drink from that. Like, I, I'm just imagining like a massive punch bowl, couple bottles of this with coconut rum, like the Malibu coconut rum. Oh my god, like, dude. Dude, like perfect summer sauce. Like Aussies will Aussies will love this. Aussies will love this. Vodka, anything, man. Anything. That sauce has made me really happy. Packed full of flavor. Heat. I mean I mean it's got the Kang style lemon starburst. Oh, I'm getting no heat. Um new chili head, entry level chili head. Yeah, you might cop a little bit of heat, but flavor i mean second to none everyone's having it on salads uh, well I, i'm just having it out of the bottle so <laughs> mm. oh, the perfect those pineapples are really really sweet so you get the awesome sweetness from the pineapples then that coconut rum in the background it's 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 really really a tasty sauce i mean I can't get enough of it. I'm just trying to scrape what I can. Wow. <laughs> it's not just Aussies, UK's lives. Oh, definitely, definitely. But I'm saying, like, Aussies love pineapple. 
Uh, so, yeah, I mean, a perfect summer Aussie sauce, this one. It gets really, really hot here in Australia in the summer. That would be so refreshing. Again, like Drew's been saying, everyone's having it on salads. I'm having it straight out of the, well, the whole bottle. I'm going to have to contact you, man. You need to make me like five litres of this thing, man. Just let me know how much because, dude, honestly, that's – what can I say? <laughs> honestly, what can I say? That sauce is incredible. Like I said, I'm so lucky with what I do in my chili career that every now and again you get one of those sauces that just make you so happy and – this is one of them. Uh, guys, get your hand. Hey, I'm, I'm not taking away from this He's on Fire because that is incredible. But the illusion and He's on Fire, guys, from Gammy's Hot Sauce, get yourself a bottle. I don't know what you're doing with your life, but you definitely need one of these for after Christmas. You're not going to get it before Christmas. After Christmas, the New Year, New Year's is coming up. Put that in a punch bowl or something. You'll love it. Get your hands on some Gammy's hot sauce. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Get your hands on some. 50-50 with Bacardi. Facebook user. I don't know who you are. Perfect. I mean, this stuff is incredible. I mean, what, what else can I say? Get your hands on some Gammy's hot sauce. Links in the description below. I'll even paste it again down here in the comments. Hit up Gammy's Hot Sauce. Get yourself a bottle of Illusion and he's on fire. Thank you so much for watching another episode of Kem's Killer Sources. And as always, stay killer. Stay killer.